We're back. Bare Bones Rock, guys. You know what I've noticed? You know what I've noticed? Get around here, camera. You're our Barberpa camera. Kachuka camera. Saibiba camera. Kalana camera. Farba camera. All the mechanisms a day of garbage. The wheel bearing, very too much small on your car. What a dumb idea, the size of that wheel bearing on your car. Really dumb. Engineering by dumb. That's what you're living with. What I find going on, and there's part of it, cruelty in employment. Employment has so much cruelty and it's staggering. And they get away with it. Bloody murder. I watch people go through stuff in employment that if you tried it on the street, you'd be killed. No one would tolerate. You try that in somebody's home, they'd kill you. And get away with it. You treat each other that way in each other's homes, you would be slaughtered and the court would back you up. And yet in employment it goes on. Staggering. And they'll sit there and allow each other and say nothing to each other. Why the, why the so-called boss railroads and jades and smashes everybody's reputation to hell to keep his own. Then when the help busts their ass and makes the boss look good, only the help's doing it, you go to the boss's boss and try to compliment the help to that boss's boss. He'll try to hold the boss liable for all the wonderful things going on. I said, no, it's the help and that son of a bitch had his way, they'd never get anything done. The picky little papipa. Looking for its reputation, not giving one goddamn about anybody. The customer, the rest of the employees, nothing. Just the boss guarding its own reputation to another boss that doesn't know what the hell's going on. Wanna bet? I just had one of those experiences in a, in a restaurant chain. It was staggering. All they were doing was hiding the, the situation from the vice president. All the bosses were. And the employees weren't getting any credit for anything going on that anybody got any credit for. The boss was taking all the credit and not the employees. Staggering to me. Give me my afterlife. I'm going to find your maker and gouge it in front of each one of you. Let's see how you like it. I have the ability to gouge your creator in front of you. And believe you me, I fully intend. Well, it ain't nothing. The afterlife's a lot better. Because there I gouge your creator by bragging all the dream. You're part of your creator. You don't know that. You are part of your creator's anatomy and tissue. You don't know that. I do. You're absolutely like a part of your maker's anatomy. When I find you in that dream chamber, I find so much more of you than you ever got to live. The parts of you that didn't live will eat what did live. What a bat! And I'll get that going. Ha ha! And then sit and laugh at you while the rest of you's eating what you lived. What a bat! And I'll look right in your face and laugh while you're being devoured by yourself. The nice part of you that ate the shitty part of you. I'll laugh in your face. Get ready for that. You want a prediction? I'll tell you an absolute occurrence. Already pre-built. I'm headed straight at it. You can't get away. Ha ha ha! See these teeth? They're made to eat you. And all your mocking of this place. Because mm -hmm. you had quite a bit of life that didn't. And you wouldn't use it. I'll take all that life that's wonderful and eat what you're doing right now. Ha ha ha! I'll find that in your maker's dream chamber. Are you ready for that? I'll make it very vividly clear to you what's happening here. Like it! I'm state's evidence for that occurred. Like me? I'm just grabbing information. How do you like me? Yum yum, eat him up. My name's Uncle George. Like me? And you keep kicking me in the ass with that damn... Come on, brain bottle rocket. hi -ya! That's called a Roman candle, stupid brain. My brain has to talk to itself because it's so dumb. Poor brain. Given to me by an asshole creator. Wow. I struggle. How about you? I look for that day that I get to eat. <laughs> Yum yum, eat him up. Looking for you there. I'm looking for you. Yum yum, eat him up. Looking for you and your failure. And won't admit it. I don't care if you failed, it's the parent that you won't admit it. Ha ha ha.